it through the first half of our Sunday uh, very similar. I'm talking with lots of sunshine and beautiful temperatures. As we make it into our uh, afternoon hours, we will see the chance for some wet weather. We're talking also the chance for uh, some isolated thunderstorms and possibly seeing some of this wet weather make it into our overnight hours. We do get through tomorrow with on and off again uh, rain chances, but by Tuesday and through the end of our work week, things are looking dry and bright. As for today, we do start off with those bright conditions. Our highs today positioning themselves in the mid to upper 70s across the region. You'll see those upper 70s across Staten Island, Brooklyn, Queens as well. So if you're heading out along the island today or the Jersey Shore, note the temperatures will be slightly cooler, still in the mid to upper 70s, depending on where you are. But I'm mostly wanting to point to those water conditions. We do see our waves ranging from about one to four feet there, and those rip current risk are coming down from where we saw yesterday. So back down to a moderate condition and our UV index sitting at a six for today. Dew point tracker does show that we will be at the very bottom of the list. So our dew points in the 50s, which all in all means that today it is going to be very dry out there. So feeling quite lovely. Despite that, you want to make sure to get on your sunscreen and always find some shade. Limit your time in the sun if you can, because it only takes about 30 minutes for that sunburn to settle in. Air is good outside today. It's been this way since yesterday. Our air quality index at a 39 and our pollen count falling today. It was at that medium level to start our weekend down to a low to medium, and that's because we do have those rain chances filtering through here. So again, ragweed and grass is just a couple of our culprits there. High pressure to thank for our dry conditions this morning, but we do have some clouds that will start to make their appearance as we get into our afternoon. So I'm thinking around lunchtime. And then after those clouds filtering in, here comes the wet weather. And we're talking about uh, it bringing the chance not just for some rain showers, but also the possibility of some isolated thunderstorms. Here's a look at our future cast. Those clouds moving in, and then here comes the wet weather. Again, it's expected to make it into our evening hours. And by the time we make it into our overnight hours, things should have dried out. But it is possible to see some of this wet weather lingering into our early morning. Otherwise, our lows tonight at 65 degrees. And a quick check out your seven day forecast so it shows those beautiful conditions Tuesday through next weekend.